Let me show you in this video in less than six minutes. We're going to install Code 17. We're going to do full installation. We're going to maintenance and we're going to optimize it. And it will be good for any OS system phones, Android devices, Raspberries, Linux, Windows 10, anything that runs in operating system. And the only thing it's going to take is six minutes. It's must see video. How are we doing everyone? This is the real familiar box. And what we're going to do today, we're going to install the Kodi 17 across the board. Will be good from any device, any Android device, any media box in this beautiful installation. So the only thing that's going to change is the download because I'm going to show you one download, but will be all the same. Okay. So let's go to Kodi.tv. We're going to hit download. Okay, we're going to go all the way down to Kodi 17. This is the part you got to choose to. If you learn Linux, you're going to click Linux, Windows 10, okay, or OS, okay, Raspberry Pi. If you're running any Android device, okay, you need to click here. You need to click here. ARM, you see here, this is ARM.7, 32 bit, so you're going to click over here, okay, any Android device is right there, okay. So in this case, I'm going to show you on Windows 10, but we'll be all the same. So if you're in a box, you open the browser, you download it, and you execute it. So let's go into Windows 10. Let's install Windows 10. Again, this is Windows 10, but we'll be the same in any other operating system, okay? Just different screen, so we agree because this is Windows 10. We click less, so we click next, and we install it. Okay, so we got Kodi running for first time. So you follow me, this is cross the border in any system. You go all the way to there, to the wheel. We have enter. And enter, we move to the system settings. Safety settings, we move all the way down to errands. We move to the right, turn on unknown source. You must have to do that, okay? So it says yes, okay? So now over here, you're gonna press escape key once. We're gonna go all the way down to file manager. And finally, manage, we're going to hit source. And we're going to type exactly this. If you see there, okay. Then we're going to hit enter. We're going to leave the name repo. We put okay. No arrows, nothing. That's good. We're going to hit escape once. Or if you're on the remote control, as a return key. Okay, another escape once. Okay. We move to errands. We have enter right in errands. Move up again, right over there. And we are going to install it from a zip file. What we call it repo. We click repo. And we are going to install this one, the first one. Okay, repository echo uh, 0.104. Maybe possible can change. If it's different number, you click that one there. We click OK. As you see there, got to reinstall it. Now, pretty easy, we're going to move up into install from repository. Okay. Right there. Programs. And the wizard. We go down all the way to install. We wait a little bit. If you see there, it's getting installed. It's installed. Okay. Is enabled so right over here now we don't need to move we click again and now we're gonna go open we wait a little bit so now let's go and do some maintenance first okay so we're gonna go all the way down to maintenance tool right in maintenance tool we click on it and we're gonna make it easy okay every time you start Cody it will clean everything so it will clean the cache it will clean the package side right over here. It will clean all this for you. So if you run a phone, if you run in, in an Android box, you'll be okay. You no longer have any me memory problem. So after that, we're going to go all the way up. Let me use the mouse so you can see it. We can click the two dots. So we resolve the maintenance. Now let's go and speed it up the system, fix some cache. Okay. So right over here, advanced settings, we click. Right there. Now, 
pay attention to your device fire stick you're going to click there okay amazon fire tv you're going to click there if you're going to be a shield in any device it is less than 512. i will say most of the people right there one gigabyte model run so if you got any android device that's the one you want to choose if you run windows 10 you want to choose that one mac you want to choose that one okay so we click on it it's going to download it now we take care buffers we make the system works beautiful and nice it's set for your system okay so now we go to the build okay right over here official echo build we hit right there we wait that's the version you want to install is the only version we click on it we're gonna hit download now we wait what's going to do now is going to download it and after download it's going to unzip it so i'm going to pause the screen we'll go back and i'll show you when it's unzip it okay so now it's going to unzip it it's going to take about a minute okay this point is very important most of the system if you run an android you need to unplug the box okay make sure you don't run anything at this point since it's windows 10 it's going to quit so it's okay so you press ok will quit okay so at this point we say yes if you run any other device and if you're going to click you're going to click yes and it's not going to quit on you my recommendation take the power and restart the box again do not run anything and done that's it just give you a little bit of time maybe like 15 to 20 minutes for um update but yeah we get the movies guys tv shows sport and all you need make sure you leave a comment share between your friend and this is dario from media box ent and if you didn't subscribe yet to the channel this is the chance right after this i'll see you next time bye